Hey guys, what's up? It's Ultimate Tech Source here from johnsiphone.com and today we're going to be looking at an app for the iPad called Splashtop Desktop Remote Control for the iPad. Now this is in the App Store for only $1.99 and it pretty much does the exact same thing as Logman Ignition which costs $30. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, so here we are in the App Store and as you can see it's called Splashtop Remote Desktop for iPad and this is $1.99 just for Father's Day weekend. I didn't mention that before but it is $1.99 for Father's Day weekend so you guys should really go and check this out and it normally will run you $10 so after Father's Day weekend it's going to cost you 10 bucks. and um, it pretty much does the exact same thing as Logman Ignition but gives you pretty much a live it's not as laggy, why did I say that weird, not as laggy, <laughs> but um, it, it, I would definitely recommend this over Logman Ignition any day, just for the price and for what it does as well. So, once we go ahead and open Splashtop, I gotta cover my IP here, alright, um, so pretty much it'll have your list of computers on here, and you can just go ahead and click it, but hold on. You will need to install actually an app on your computer for this. This runs on Windows and um, Macs. You're going to need to go to your web browser and download an app um, from Splash. Um, desk, no, Splash. Um, it'll, it'll be below, all right? <laughs> Just go to that website and download it and install it. And once we click on the app, it is connecting to your computer and you will get hints and if you can see on my computer now it kind of shrunk the screen because right here is just black and it cuts off right here and um, it says it is now being probably can't see that because my screen is too bright but it says Eric's iPad 2 is now controlling this computer and now it really is so let me go ahead and go ahead and it gives you these hints and you can turn it on or off I just keep it on because sometimes I forget for my first time using it. Well, my this is like my fifth, but go ahead and click OK to like you can close out all this stuff. And just close that out, and you pretty much have your desktop. So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom this out here, kind of pan out here and try and give you guys a look at both my desktops right there. The exact same thing. So let's go back in here and take a look at what you can exactly do inside this app. So it's, it, I'm looking on my computer right now and it's reacting to pretty much everything I do like as fast as I do it too. So you can do anything that you can in Logman Ignition. You can drag it. You can see it's not very laggy even though I am on Wi-Fi. It's, it's really nice. And you can also scroll your screen which I'll do right now. Let me just turn it up like this but you can use three fingers and scroll it downward here and you can drag it back up and of course you can always resize it as well but we're going to be looking at this in landscape so yeah you have your keyboard you can just click that button there and you have your full keyboard here you got your command alt control shift escape tab F1 through F12, and then you got some arrows and delete, and then you can actually write in here, I think. Yeah, you can write a whole paragraph, I guess, and you can send it. I don't know what that's exactly for, but yeah. And you pretty much just have a full keyboard here, and that's really the app. It's pretty much the exact same thing as Logman Ignition, but for only $1.99 on Father's Day weekend only. So go ahead and check this out. I really, really, really recommend it. Probably 10 out of 10 stars, maybe 9 out of 10. I don't know why. But it's uh, definitely a 10 out of 10 app. So remember, just download the app from the App Store for your iPad. Go to your web browser and download it off of the website that I'll put in the description. And you will have a remote desktop and yeah so this was ultimate tech source from john's iphone.com go ahead and check them out below follow me on twitter at old tech source and don't forget to like the video comment and subscribe i'll see you guys in the next video peace